What are we playing here? Band Prophet. Knowing me, you're gonna be like trying to wrap up and everyone's gonna be like, yo, raid of 10,000 people. Warlock and Shadow Shaman on my jams. Weaver? Oh, Weaver's sweet. Yeah, Shadow Shaman's good as well. I, I don't play Shadow Shaman enough, to be honest. I think I neglect it too much. It's a good position for a player, a uh, character, a hero. I think I can build this deck in paper, actually. Weaver's like broken with, um, it's not broken, but it's really good with, uh, what's that card? Um, Echo Saber? So sweet. Alright, I'm gonna play some practice games since we're just gonna muck around for a few games. Yeah, Echo Saber's sweet, right? Like, you just like double shot and then Echo Saber triggers and you like double shot again. I don't know if it stacks, but that'd be kind of sweet. Thank you for the follow, I appreciate the love here, mate. Cyclopomp, thank you for the follow, I appreciate it. We'll play some Band Prophet Griffiths at the moment. Used to love Skyrath, Skyrath Mage, but he dies too fast. Yeah, he does, he does. It's kind of very fragile. Um, yeah, I don't think I've actually played too much of that. I think I played him on random once. Like, there's a bunch of heroes I have not even touched. Like, I go so deep on trying to learn a hero for so long. Like, I have not played all the pandas. Like, back in my day, pan the pandaren was like a one panda thing. Uh, but now it's like three pandas, right? It's like the fire one, which is like super competitive in the pro league. Um, there's the one that turns into the green one that turns into a stone. And then there's the storm spirit, which is also competitive. Yeah, storm spirit is super competitive. So back in my day, pandas used to split into three. I think they still do, right? Do they still do that? Void Spirit 2, Brewster. Uh, oh, that seems good. Got a bunch of card draws and a profit. Keep this. This used to be a Yurion deck, by the way. No more Yurion anymore. Whoa, is this a uh, Gak? If it's Gak, I'm fine with Gak. Yeah, good luck trying to get around the swords. Primeval Titan. I feel like that's a Cloudless deck. Is this giant? Elf. What? What is this? Oh, this could um, this could be um, what's his name? Uh, too bad we don't have a white source. This could be uh, Green White and Claimer, the Franz build, right? It's post. How could we? How do you know it's post? Oh, sorry, sorry, WCH. We've changed deck list. We're playing Bant, uh, Bant Profit now. Let me go ahead and update the stream deck for you. And we just changed. We just changed to the new one just then. Playing Bant Profit with Kufix. Okay, I've uh, updated. It. Just go ahead and refresh the stream. Should be, should be up. We're gonna have a White Souls now. And a Ice Fang, I guess. If you go ahead and click deck list again, you should be able to see it now. Cheers, mate. No worries. Alright, there's plenty of white sources now. Um So we can technically still play this. So I'm gonna wait until I ta activate obviously. But yeah, I can uh, just chill out. Then activate end step, and then we eat it. Oh, they didn't do it! <laughs> they didn't do anything. They named Elf, because it could- But the Elf doesn't play Primeval Titan, I'm so confused. Oh, it is Cloudpost. Okay, gotcha. Why didn't they activate the Elvish Reclaimer? Isn't that what they're supposed to do? Excavator? I'm so confused. Alright, they're both gonna get eaten. Uh, mate, I think you missed out on your opportunity. <laughs> to activate this at the end step. 
Oh, everything's everything's gone to heaven. Mate. All right. So we don't need to green suns for a profit. That's the whole point of the deck. We just literally just want profit graphics in play. Um, okay. So my plan here is to get a dust watch recruiter so I can draw a bunch of cards with profit. That's that normally the jam. I also can get an oro. But basically, the whole entire plan is profit graphics, and then you just draw tons of cards. So, going to attack for one here. That's a, or a, or is not too bad actually, he technically draws a card. No, I think we need Dust Watch. Because it, it draws so much cards. And next turn I'm going to be able to get a profit and play. And I don't think the opponent's going to counter it. Yeah, they aren't stopping the profit next turn. Yeah, 100%, man. I, I know this deck inside out, right? I'm the admin on the uh, Facebook group. I used to like Thought Nazi on this deck. You like, to be able to Thought Nazi people on the draw step is hilarious. Unless they play like Warping Whale or something, kind of awkward. I also think secretly Warping Whale is like one of the best charms ever, right? You have like the Naya charm, whatever. Warping Whale is amazing. <laughs> Two mana does everything. Well, not everything, but you get what I mean, right? The Suba. Naming Glimmer Post. It's kind of hilarious that they uh, named Cavern. I mean, Cavern named Elf, but they uh, used the forest to cast the, El uh, the Reclaimer, right? Like, wouldn't you name? You also reveal a prime time, so wouldn't you name giant? And now they name giant. So I need to figure out how to stop this giant as well. What have they got here? A, a dryad? I think people have been playing dryads in green, in green post now. <laughs> what are you doing? Mate, what do you got? It's just. Okay, yeah, and they want to get a reclaimer again? Sure. Your yeah, reclaimer is so important in this deck though. It made green post good again. It made blue green post only need to be green <laughs> because of reclaimer. Yeah, they really want this reclaimer in play, right? Do we, oh, I don't think we play Skyclave in the main. No, we have Recruiter, which I think second can do stuff. But again, there's a few turns for it to come online. And this Recruiter. So the Recruiter's great, right? We can flash in Recruiter, get a get whatever we want so random let's cast a 2-3 legacy for 5 mana right this is a wombo combo here folks whoop Whoa, profit! So, when Companions was a thing, by the way, folks, when Companion was released, I could flash in Profit Acryphics to save... No, flash in my Urion to save my Profit. I can't do that anymore because of the tax. But it was amazing, right? Obviously, there was other broken things like Zerda and, and Loris, but when Companion tax was not a thing, I'd just be like, oh, play Profit Acryphics, pass, and then try to kill it, I'm like, flash it in. Exile everyone. It's all good. We're all good. <laughs> Sacking the dude. Yep, you got it. Alright, so getting plo post here, that obviously can do a bunch of things. Alright, we're gonna just basically tutor for anything we want. The good old end step tutor, put it in our hand. Not for anything, but we can get a Hydro Crisis if we want to be an asshole. Uh, oh, I can Brazen Borrower. I forgot that I did that at Trick A. Um, <laughs> that's a lot of things we can get here. Yeah, I should have maybe did that upkeep. All right, so they have a prime time in their hand, which is kind of problematic, right? And they, when they reveal I Vigan, I left from the once upon a time. All right, so they're gonna have lots of mana. That's three, four, five, six, seven. So they're gonna have I Vigan mana next, and they have a prime time as well. So I need to figure out how to deal with this.
They're on 22. I need a way to kill. I should like put a better card in here to kill stuff. This deck is very grindy, as you can see. I don't even know what the word means. There's Dishtenku? I don't know what that means. <laughs> uh, like Jank Deluxe. Yeah, yeah, I mean, I tried, I tried my best, man. I think I like Brazen Brava. Uh, I'm also on their turns. So I don't care about Brazen Borrowing now. <laughs> French Spilling? Alright. Cool, draw land. Oh, real swords. That deals with the um, easy. That deals with the the prime time. So I guess I just petty theft this guy. Get him out of here. Cast. I also can activate, because I can cast her on my turn, so I just activate this. See what we get. Another profit. Sure. There's a guy's cradle. Sure. Uh, and then pass. Untap everything. Alright, so they're going to be able to jam prime time now, and I'm going to eat it. They're going to get a bunch of lands, which is unfortunate, but hopefully they're dead by then. <laughs> They're definitely casting this giant. Yeah, you're right. Venser. Venser's a good one. Maybe we should put Venser in the deck. Trade Wind Rider. So many options. So many options. Maybe we should wait to the, for them to get the lands first. It's okay. I'm just being transparent, I guess. Golf Squid. Creature, Squid Beast. When Golf enters the battle, tap all lands, target player controls. <laughs> oh, I want to play that card. It's a 2-2? That means I can fetch it. That's awesome. Alright, okay, they got two Cloud Post. Uh, I guess the better opportunity here is actually activating. I can put on pressure, but I, for them being on 22 life, he's not the greatest. Uh, I guess I Fang... I mean, they got a million mana, so I don't think it matters here. Uh, Ice Fang lets us um, draw a card, go a little bit deeper. That's what she said. This the whole entire deck literally is just like, I'm trying to vomit my permanence on the battlefield, let me do it please. It doesn't do anything powerful, it just does simple things. I don't even know if it's good to be honest. It doesn't even have to play Force of Will. So the opponent's obviously doing their thing, we're just letting them do it. <laughs> Trade wins control sounds sick. How do I bounce it though? I want to be able to bounce it to my hand. We're playing, um, what's that? What's that? Sabretooth dude that bounces a creature and it becomes indestructible. No, also I can just play, it's blue, right? Yeah, I just play, uh, there's a true name. I just play the stupid Kuiper Harpy, right? Oh man, I can't, I can't stop this IV man, they're just gonna kill me to death. How do I, how do I stop them from doing their thing? I should, of all cards, I should have Stoneforge in this deck. In, in, I used to have, um, what's his name? I used to have, what's the other card called? Um, uh, what's Fist Empath? I used to have Fist Empath because I'd go Recruiter, Fist Empath, grab Sun Titan, and then um, Sun Titan people to death. But I'm not doing that at the moment. Under High Group Crisis can be just massive. I also probably need um, Opposition Agent in this as well. Yeah, I just get a Giant Crisis, I guess. I'm doing such average things. <laughs> oh, 
or just opposition literally yeah you're right literally just opposition <laughs> why don't i just play opposition right that would enhance my plan yeah that's a good point because i just untap everything right i <laughs> that's hilarious let's let's put it in after this game how many are we talking like two three i'm sure i can cut some cards i think kira is probably not the greatest in this deck And maybe, oh yeah, I thought about back to basics as well. Because like, I untap my, like even though it will hurt my lands, I also untap my stuff. So they're gonna dis destroy us now with the Eye Vigo. Stone Cold Serpent, yeah that's true. I mean I got a Hydro Crisis coming up soon. They're, they're gonna be out of Ulamog, I guess. Cause they can't, like, oh wait, can they? That's 15, tap Ivuga, and that goes to an 8. Okay, that's a smart move, yeah. You probably want to crop rotation then, yep. Okay, now they can end recall, I think. Yeah, because that's uh, 6 mana, so that's 12, 13, 14. Yeah, they can end recall now. This is the part where I first get Venser. <laughs> we can block, it's fine, you're right, we can block. <laughs> you are correct. Uh, sh okay. So does this mean I want more permanents in play, so I should flash in Brazen Borrow and Profit? Like, how many mana we got? Five? Okay, we can't flash in both. Emmy's not indestructible. I know, I know, I know. But I also need to think about Annihilator, which I can go like one, two, maybe three. Actually, I'm going to Hydro Crisis, why not? Just draw some cards. I'm going to sack it anyway. Let's draw two cards. There's the Cradle. Whoa! Activate Duskwatch a million times! <laughs> oh, I forgot! I keep on tapping! <laughs> I forgot about that part! <laughs> Alrighty. I just keep on tapping. Uh, okay, let's activate this guy. Let's see what we get. Nothing? Okay. I guess we just flash in Brazen Brawl then. I forgot to. I guess we just flash in Brazen. And we just sack a bunch of random things. We just... This, this Ice Fang is doing MVP duty. <laughs> Oh, we've got many things to attack here, to, to sack here. I know, later six. Okay. Brazen. I guess Hydro Crisis. Recruiter, Recruiter. I guess we don't care about the Noble. We've got a bunch of mana. Maybe just an Ice Bang, right? We also have another Prof in our hand. No, we can. Maybe the true name. Trudeau also lets me attack through them. They, they still have the- no, they, I've killed the prime time. You're right, he can trudeau it again and cast it. If we kill it. I suck- oh, land, yeah, land, put a good point. So you got the cradle? Yeah, it's a good point. You good point, he can just recast it, so we might be just dead. Or, we let him hit us. We let them hit us. <laughs> I I agree. I don't think we block now. Maybe I should have kept my um my tr my hydro crisis and the true name. I mean the all the powered creatures. You don't think we block? I don't think we block. You're right. Because he's just gonna recast it. But then they also can just get Ulamog. That's a good point. Chat had a good point. I could have killed them maybe if I just sacked all my lands. Because we also have a cradle. Isn't a win. Good point. Yeah, let's. let's... You think block? But Andy Prime. You don't, you don't have Death Touch. Good point. Okay. 
Any prime's pretty on point, but I'm gonna go with my mod here. There's just Oh no, I sacked the wrong land! Okay, we're dead. Cause it's the snow. I sacked the snow. I'm such an idiot. Okay, so they had a little mog in their hand. We saved 15 life, correct. <laughs> I think we're dead. Folks, I think we're dead here. That's okay. We had, uh, we had fun. Let's see what we're going to draw. A bunch of profits, alright. So this is obviously gay one, so we, we have some time here. Skyclaves can hit... Do we want to search? No, we don't have ways to destroy stuff. We don't destroy stuff in Bant. What are you talking about? Um, I think Meddling Mage could be a thing. Gotta take and stop their green suns? That's pretty much all it does. I also can mind break their Emrak their Eldrazi. Is that is that am I am I asking for too much? Is that just too too thin of a line? Does two profit No no it does not. It does not cause two triggers. It's not a trigger, you just you just get it. It's not it's not wilderness reclamation. I think I can name like crop rotation with this. I feel like Thalia does nothing. Get rid of that one. You can pay all the life. I could, of course I played three swords. I'm an idiot. Hull breach, I feel like they're not doing anything. Yeah, you're talking about wilderness. Kira, I don't care about. I feel like they're not targeting my stuff. True also generally kills. I mean, I have a version of this where I have Stoneforge and Judas. But why why would I want to play legacy cards? I'm trying to make a modern deck here. I mean Hullbridge is on the axis that they have. No, I'm gonna get rid of Hullbridge. I feel like on their axis they have Silver Library, but I don't think they do. I did not bring the mind breaks in. I was just worried that it was just too cute. Yeah, I'll give this. Noble into Ice Fang. A uh, Noble into uh, Recruit as well. Even Noble into True Name. I think that could even be a threat. Unfortunately, my Recruiters can't even get profit because it says toughness to a list. Uh, good, cool, cool, uh, cool card. I guess I have to get blue, right? I don't want to give them mana. Yeah, I'm gonna kill them. True name. Unless I don't get blue. This, this card is so good. I feel like true name's good though. I I, I think I want to kill them. True name. So let's give them mana. Let me chat for a quick second. Is True Name better now than them, for them to have one mana? I think True Name's just... They just they can't deal with it, right? Unless they have Ugin or all of dust. I agree. And it's also a 4-1, right? A 4-2. This recruiter also can get Skyclave. They didn't even use the mana. I'm going to Sylvan Library and just pay a million life. <laughs> The reclaimer, sure. Cool, we can do two things now. Uh, yes, yeah, so I'm gonna do this first, just see if I draw the swords off the top. I did not. Alright, library it is. Getting a Savannah.
All right, they got a little pose getting a bit alive, which is awkward. What are they doing? Excavator? Frozen grip. Sure, you got it. <laughs> Aww. Obviously the sack, yep. Oh, there's the swords. Um... Question is, do I swords now? Oh, I don't know why I attacked with this. That's a good point. I should have attacked. I'm gonna recruit her here. Also, tempted to not play land. I'm gonna eat that now. Of course, they get a cloud post, right? Question is, they're gonna untap with seven mana. They could get like if they play a cloud post, they'll have eight, nine. I don't mind getting a meddling mage here. The thing I'm the only thing I'm scared about is Ulamog. I mean prime time's also a card. Yeah, all on Emmy. I don't think I think they're dead before I get to Emmy. Okay, so they can prime time. Well, there you go. Yeah, I forgot about the carpet. Oh, they also had the forest, sorry. I knew about the carpet, but they didn't have the forest before, so. I guess technically I didn't need the swords, the. Uh, I didn't need the swords, the. Reclaimer, then I could have just played a land off the re recruiter, gotten the meddling mage and just named prime time and then swords it later. But they can just keep activating, that's the problem. Yeah, well, I think we're dead, folks. Unless I play the crisis here in hoping that I draw. Uh, I can play Ice Fang here. Hope I draw a sword. These subcasters, I think. I don't have enough instant sorceries though. Township. Oh, I did have that card in this <laughs> deck. I forgot about that. Um, Township's kind of cool. I guess attacking with the true name is basically the same. What have they got? I was just say what? Maybe I'll recall here then. I can attack ones, I can chomp. Oh, I can't actually chomp because it's trample. My bad. Yeah, I'm gonna name Miracle because they have tons of mana now, and they could get out Eye Vegan, right? Chasm. Why would they pre combat Chasm? <laughs> Why wouldn't they attack first? Why would... Attack first! <laughs> I have full power in play. Yeah, I think that was a mistake. Oh, they got a Kozilek. I mean, that that's rough. They just gotta draw four cards, I guess. Uh, 
All right, I guess we can Hydro Crisis. They're gonna sack an next turn and just kill me. All right, at this point they have unlimited mana, so I'm just gonna play the land out. How much is this? One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, we're just hoping for a sword here, folks. No swords. No dice. This is Menace, isn't it? No, it's the wrong old one. Okay. I think we're dead. I know that attack did nothing, but, you know, I've lost hope now. Wow, they had two Carpets in their hand? Oh, they also didn't sack the Chasm. So they still can't attack. I would have just sucked the chasm. I guess they're just playing with their food at the moment. They have another prime time? Or green suns maybe. Okay, once upon a time. There's a time. <laughs> you got another prime time. <laughs> Talk about going big, mate. Yeah, this opponent uh, definitely wants to cast big creatures, let's just say that. Tabernacle? Mate, so mean. They have Tabernacle? I guess they brought it on the side, right? Yeah, we're gonna scoop it up here, folks. Anyways, that was fun. That was a fun deck. Anyways, thanks for watching everyone. I'm going to scoop it up here and just wrap up. It's getting kind of late for me. I'm going to go have a shower and stuff. So, um, thanks for watching. Thanks for hanging out. Um, hope everyone is staying safe and being cool. Uh, if, again, like I was saying earlier, if you want me to play your deck uh, and you have a cool list, uh, you know, if you want to cover the league, yeah, good night, good night. If you want to cover the league, feel free to send me some ticks and then uh, I can play your deck. Uh, that's also fine as well. Uh, if not, I'll just find my own decks and, and play whatever I want. But um, appreciate all the love, appreciate all the hanging out and support. Everyone have a good night and see you later. I'll see who I can raid you all to now.